Hey guys, we're back with round two. Um, yeah, last round was horrible. That sack, though. Okay, this opening hand is actually pretty bad. Good grade three in hand, though. Good grade three. Gotta really shuffle this up. And give me a grade one. Grade one? Oh, of course. Oh god, no great ones. It's okay, it's okay. I can still hit a 10k column so I can do damage at least. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and go first since I lost last game and Fuck. And... Alright, now let's see what happens. Oh my god, he gets the citrus. He gets the citrus right. Why? Why, why do you have to get citrus? Oh, uh, no guard. I don't even have enough guarding in hand. Uh, at least he gets a heal tree, that's not that important. Oh. The fuck? Heals invisible damage. And his turn. Draw. Fuck. Okay, we'll just go ahead and swing 10. Yep, I'm definitely using Goyusha this turn. Or this game. Definitely using Goyusha. Um, making it a 1. Doesn't break, but he got he has Grappa. That's not good. I don't need him getting Grappa. Get the heal trigger. Okay, so this is gonna let me catch up completely. Boom. Healed up. Alright, so now he writes Sabuhime, puts Grappa on rear guard. That was not a good play. I am sorry, buddy, that was not a good play. I'm gonna actually get a little defensive this game. I'll let him get the soul charge. Okay, if I play a little defensive, I can slow the game down a little bit, allowing me to go ahead and get Dykeiser out there. And I can hit an 18 column, so. Oh shit! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, that, that. Don't worry about this. Don't worry about this. You're not watching anything. I totally didn't just misplay out the ass. <laughs> okay, so no break. Then we'll let the real guard, the rear guard swing, and it doesn't. Hit. Yeah, he's playing a little defensive too. I don't know why, but oh, he had to ride Minerva. Oh, he did a cross ride. Oh, okay. Ten, you can die. No guard. I'll uh, 
Kuna Red, the Kai of the Die of the Zard, and 18 Vamp. Magic number, but he no guards it. Draw trigger, power to Vanguard. Don't draw a grade 3. Fuck. <laughs> For the record, guys, I don't play Dykeiser for Dykeiser's Break Red. I don't give a shit about the Break Red. The Break Red skills, honestly, they're in my deck to scare the opponent. I'll show you why I play Great Dykeiser here in a minute. Okay, 17, I gotta drop a 10 on this, I think. This is gonna be an ATK column. I will take this one. Draw trigger, power to Vanguard. And I get that draw. Ooh, that is that's gonna be a fucking saver. Okay, so then I'll just go ahead and drop it, making it a two. Uh oh, he's gonna give it all to Rearguard, I think. Uh oh, no, he didn't. Oh, <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay, so I'm safe. So here comes the 17, and I guard with 5. So now it's my turn, and I can cross break right. Actually, do I want to cross break right right now? Can I last another turn? 1, 2, 3, 4. Uh, I think I might just do a little bit of pressure. I'm not totally sure. You know what? I know for a fact if I go ahead and break right right now, I will definitely last because of hand size and shit. So then I can go ahead and call another die to the rear guard. And put a die dragon out there so that they have to attack him. So then this is gonna be that. I'm not gonna use limit break right now. I'm gonna space out the pressure I can give to him. So it's just gonna be like this. Two crit. He drops a quintet wall, I'll be kinda fucked. If he drops a perfect guard, I'll have a chance to kill. But I'm only drive checking two times, not three. Oh, he went no guard. Let's see what happens. Critical. <laughs> Crit to van. Does he get a heal? He gets a crit? What about a heal trigger? No heal trigger. Oh, what the hell? Okay, so we get a round three. 